Hey, it's Mike, and right now I want to talk about Upwork because they had one of the best performances and one of the strongest days of the year it was up almost 44%. It was because of just blowout earnings. Um, you know, the gig economy is just keeps growing and growing and growing. In fact, there are there's a gig ETF that I believe is among the top performing ETFs of the year, along with all the ARK Invest ETFs. And the thing about Upwork, uh, the reason why I believe Upwork is probably the best of breed is because Upwork has sort of the highest quality and highest paid gig economy workers. Um, you know, you look at Fiverr, Fiverr is a great company and it's sort of a volume seller. Um, I'm just going to take a look at Fiverr stock right now. Like, you know, Fiverr went up 10% as well. They have a market cap of $6 billion. Um, let me see. Oops, I'm back on NanoX. Um, but Upwork has a market cap of about a little more than half that of $3.5 billion. However, with Upwork, the workers there, they're mo a lot of them are full-time uh, gig uh, workers and high-level high, uh, professional workers. So I do think that Upwork has the potential to catch up with Fiverr. So, you know, up this stock being up 40%, it was a you know, two billion dollar stock a couple of days ago. Now it's at three point four. It may pull back a little bit just because you know, forty three percent one day move in a stock. You're going to have some short term sellers. However, moving forward, I would not be surprised if Upwork can uh, move up to Fiverr's market capitalization. So that, that gives it another almost one hundred percent upside. Also, it looks like if we do, if the second shutdown does intensify. That means offices will close, people will get laid off, and more people will go into the gig economy. Um, and usually what happens is people will start off with like places like Fiverr where they do work for 10, 20 bucks, and as they gain experience, then they move up to Upwork um, and get those higher paid jobs. So I would definitely keep an eye on Upwork. I would definitely keep an eye on the gig economy as well. I mean, Fiverr is doing well, Upwork is doing well. Um, I'm gonna look just real quick, the gig, uh, gig ETF. Let me see if I can find it. It's this SoFi G I G E. And let me look at because I know it's been a big performer. Let's see. Yeah, it was up five percent, and um, the year to date, it's been it's almost doubled. And I know for we see you're used to seeing stock go up four or five hundred percent, but for an ETF to go from eighteen to thirty two year to date is is really incredible. So if you're worried about individual stocks, definitely look at the um, SoFi Gig Economy ETF, G-I-G-E. Um, however, if you want to take a chance, the Upwork stock does look good. Just expect it to pull back a little bit. But this is really great news um, for this company. I remember I used to be on it when it was Odesk. So it's kind of um, weird to see it as Upwork now. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to uh, like, share, and subscribe. And go ahead and turn on notifications. I do multiple updates each day on stocks as well as options and uh, various stock investing strategies. Okay, thanks a lot. Bye.